8.38, we are back on breakfast television. It is Monday and the SBCA is in the house. Kim has brought along two very loving animals, we'll say, yes. in the commercial yes. break. You can probably visit our website if you'd like to see the full meal special there, but they've taken a bit of a break. Uh, who we got here today, Kim? We have Pipos. Pipos is a... Uh, uh, Hound mix, pointer mix, sorry. Uh, he's eight years old, eight and a bit. He's had, uh, whoa, he's had some agility training. He's actually well trained. He has some anxiety. <laughs> so is mine, apparently. Sorry. This is Buddy. Yeah. Buddy's the other, uh, he's a year and a half old. No, 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 no. Here we go. Here Retriever we go. Ah, mix. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> no, stop it. Don't look at this. <laughs> this is not what you need to see at all. No, stop it. Okay. People. So, Pipos. Kim, yes. what is, what's my guy all about? This is Buddy. But Buddy's a year, a year and a half old retriever mix. He's a, a young dog. He's come to us uh, as a result of a divorce. So he's so looking for- Why do for... people do that? I don't know. Hi. I don't know. He's, you know what? He's a great dog, fun, great family dog. He does need some obedience training though. Uh, and he's got lots of energy. Uh, you've always yeah, seen you're telling me. <laughs> so, okay, let's go back to, to, to Pipo here. And uh, he had a bit of an issue here with his vocal cords, you were telling me. Yes, uh, a previous home actually had the vet cut his vocal cords so he wouldn't bark, make a lot of noise. Is that common? No, we don't see it as often now. I, unfortunately, there are a few vets that will still do it. I think what people don't realize is if you have a highly anxious dog, you don't want to be doing that. You want to treat the emotional state that they're suffering from, the anxiety, rather than trying to just stop that noise that they're making. Barking is a very, very common thing for people yes. to do. What, what's the one easy tip that somebody could do to stop their dog from barking? Well, don't reinforce it. When your dog barks, don't say, oh, stop it, or go lay down, because you just, any, it's like kids. Any attention is, is better than nothing, so even that little telling them to stop it, you reinforce that. All right, well, uh, we had a couple of other animals on the show last week. <laughs> Let's put those graphics up while these two enjoy themselves. Uh, who's this guy? This was a, a one-eyed dog, right? This is uh, one-eyed Bob. One-eyed Bob. He's in his home, he's having one more x-ray, and then he'll be adopted. <laughs> Sorry. No, <laughs> okay. And we also had uh, this lovely guy as well. This who's is this? Isabel, she's Isabel. been adopted within, within a couple of days. She was adopted. Thank That's you very great. much. And you know what's nice too is that Kim says these most of these animals, we have a very good track yes. record here with BT, so they go pretty quickly, don't they? Quickly, quickly. If you'd like any of these two, <laughs> or any other animal for that matter, you can contact the Vancouver SPCA, the number on your screen, 604-879-7721, and visit the website as well. Kim, thank you very much. No, thank you. Look, they're out there, Michelle, they're, they're having a bit of a break. It's been a busy morning here. Ooh, it's getting hot in here. I don't know about uh, you. Yeah, these guys should go down and hang out with Dawn at the Dirty Apron. Yeah, they, they don't need the Dirty Apron. I no, don't they think. don't. They They're do not need anything. They figured that out. Together. All right. It is Pride Week. It is, though. That's just it. Perfectly timed. Thank you so much, you guys. So lots of things to do outdoors. So Riaz, it's been a, it's been quite a morning here at the Dirty Apron. I, there was quite a bit of chemistry in here as well. So perfect way to connect with a potential loved one. Yeah, thanks very much, Dawn. Speaking of chemistry, <laughs> I want to know what's the secret with these two over here because this has not stopped unbelievable SPCA yeah oh, okay that's that's good yeah that's how you know we're live all right we're taking a break here at breakfast television stay with us they'll click it's up after the break and we'll tell you how you can win tickets to a BC Lions game over at Empire Field come on back whoa all right.